Right, how do you solve a problem like Gloomhaven? I mean, organisation. Well, uh, I've had my Gloomhaven a, a bit now, the second uh, printing. I've actually played the, uh, the first part of it, first scenario if you, if you like, um, but we only punched out what we needed because to be honest, without some decent storage, oh, it's a bit of a nightmare isn't it? I've still got loads of, loads of boards all in the bits. And I was originally going to, in the pinch punch board sheets I should say, I was originally going to um, get loads of different storage but I really want it contained in the box because it takes up enough room as it is. So, the solution, uh, found this out through a thread on Board Game Geek, um, is actually a 35 uh, euro solution and that is Same Labs, that's S-A-I-M Labs. It came pretty quick as well. Uh, and it's a Bloomhaven org organiser for 35 euros. While I was at it, I got a Mage Knight one as well. So I'm guessing that's the Mage Knight one. And this one is the Gloomhaven one. So let's just have a quick look. Let's move the Mage Knight one over there. We'll have a look at that okay, one so later. Let's get into here. So this is the Mage Knight organiser. Now say 35 euros and reasonable delivery too. Uh, and this is the instructions we get with it. So I'm pretty intrigued by it. Uh, I'll see how easy it is to follow. I shall give my uh, my uh, opinion on that as well. So we've got two, two A4 sheets, one's double sided. Um, you can smell the wood, it's got a nice smell to it and it's, uh, it's actual it's plywood, strong as well, um, and laser edged in is all the symbols and stuff. It's pretty neat, isn't it? It says random monster cards here, and everything's look labelled. Item cards, uh, attack modifier cards. Looks pretty good, doesn't it? There's a ton of stuff here, look, and at a very good price. So let's see how it all goes right, together. So I've just separated everything. Uh, and this is the pieces we've got so far. So I've put duplicated pieces on top of each other. Sometimes there's quite large stacks of them. And you can see that's an ultra large stack there. This bit's fully made up already, this bit. Well, I say already, there's obviously there's some bits need going in, isn't there, in them slots there. Um, what I'm very impressed about, every single piece, if I just grab a piece, um, I know for a fact the edges are nice and smooth, but they're varnished. You see the difference in colour, and you can actually feel and smell it. So all the edges are treated with a varnish. You can actually see it speckled. See the varnish there? They've been sealed up, the edges. That is a nice touch, isn't it? Incredible value. But let's see. <laughs> Look at the amount of stuff there. That's unbelievable, isn't it? And that is €35 Euros worth. That's all. So um, let's see. How easy it is to put together and the uh, finished product. Wish me luck. Okay, so we're approximately three quarters of an hour, that's what we think. Um, and I put it together and it was really easy. It was so simple. Uh, and I'm so impressed with it. I didn't expect all the edges, as you can see with the shimmer, to be varnished. Everything etched in, laser etched in with the uh, writing and stuff. Um, very good quality. They snap together perfectly. Solid. No glue needed. You see everything's marked up. All these card ones, you put them in alphabetical order. Excellent, excellent quality. Like I say, no glue needed. Look at the precision. I'm blown away by the precision. I've worked with wood for years. And um, the precision on these, uh, this is the first uh, insert I've ever had a uh, box insert and I'm so impressed with it. Maybe they're all as good as this, but this is absolutely spot on. Look at it, it's perfect. Um, there we go. So it's all been assembled. It's a lot of stuff, isn't it? For 35 euros uh, from Same Lab. That's S A I. So there it is. I knew there was a couple of pieces had them, but there you go. So that's what you're looking for if you want this one. It's S A I M Lab. 
and that's the Gloomhaven insert. It was really easy to put together and uh, I've got the joy of punching and sorting everything else out now. Okay, we'll uh, have a take a look when it's all, we've got all the uh, pieces of Gloomhaven stored inside it. Right, welcome back to Gloomhaven because we mean to put this out but life gets in the way of doing everything else doesn't it so um yeah this board here i did have some separation of my boards uh, this one was terrible this one was practically totally delaminated it come away on both sides so i put used the prit stick on this underweight flat as a pancake now and uh, nicely glued so it's easy with a bit of prit stick isn't it sort of things like that out now we're here because of this sayon sign s-i-i-m labs uh, organizer so i've got my bits on top i think we showed all this with the removable sticker sheet and all that we played gloomhaven and it is uh, really enjoyed our foray into it so far so here's what we're, we've got i'm very impressed with this uh, box insert it's superb so we've got these bits and pieces just just go on top here we've got the lovely place perfectly for the manual here that was just the um, diagram for doing the uh, the insert, the same labs insert, and it was really easy. I think it took about, you say, 45 minutes about for me to put it together. Mm -hmm. It's a lot of insert as well, isn't it? So all this fits perfectly here, then the, then the board. Just got some pencils, some extra uh, bits for sorting cards if we needed, <laughs> even a pencil sharpener, and there's the standings stuff there. So then we, oh here, look, this bit comes straight out like that. So we've got that bit there. Nice and easy, if you had, you know, you can put all this stuff out, we've got the game board. Then we look further in. I've got some bits there, move them. And uh, we can just pull these out at our leisure. So here's one now for the large cards. And the thing is, they're listed all here. So we've got personal quest cards here, uh, random dungeon cards, uh, random monster cards and so forth. So everything's labeled so that's nice so put that out on the table easily to get hold of i can't believe all this for 35 euros to be honest it's so well done um, but i'm becoming a, a thing now where some real big complex games with lots of bits and pieces these these wooden inserts i've even got so i've got the mage knight one to do and also i've ordered um from meeple reality the um odin's banquet which is the feast for odin one which looks cracking uh, so look, all the cards sorted in there, monster cards, more monster cards, oh, we've got a rubber even and stuff in the, in the back there, but look at, you know, out straight away easy to find stuff because these are in alphabetical order as well, um, we come into here, all the different decks of cards there, and the same here, so well made. So precision, I really admire the precision. This one here, look. I'll take that off. The place for everything and everything in its place. Look, just superb. Oh, look, and even a little box here. The bits in. It's just absolutely cracking. Uh, go further in. Look. And then down here, let's get this out. The big tray. There we go. Put that there for now. And then in the bottom, we just have all the map tiles. Should we just pull all them out in a pile or leave them in the box or stand them up should come to them? And we just have the uh, the the tuck boxes here. I put the little envelopes and bits and pieces I got the standies, standies as well right so let's see how easy it is putting it all back so you've got all your stuff out on the table uh, first of all is the large tray let's get the right way around nope it's that way and this one fits in here it's quite easy to be honest so all your tiles on the bottom these here then we have uh, this tray I think it goes into this corner here that's it then we have the other tray the same size on top uh, like like that that's it then we have the longer ones coming along here I think I'm getting this right yep that's it then we have the this uh, 
one here with the large cards in there. And then these here. That's it. Fit in really nice and easy. Look at that. I mean, what precision. And then we have this tray with the models on here. And then the board. As you can see, look at that. I mean, it's just so well organised. And easy to get out, isn't it, in seconds. Then that on top. Then all your bits and pieces. Your field manual, if you like, is going to go in there. And uh, everything's going to fit in. Just lovely. And everything in its place. Um, that is the box insert for Gloomhaven. It weighs a ton, doesn't it? And it's um, everything's in there. All sorted. And that is the same labs, S A I M labs, uh, box organizer for Gloomhaven. I hope this has been used to some people. And uh, you know, these organizers really, really help, don't they, with getting set up and and tear down, and and, and accessing stuff in game. So that's been yeah, the box yeah. insert for Gloomhaven from Same Labs. Thanks for watching.